Hey guys and girls, welcome to another episode about R programming. In today's episode, I am going to teach you how to uh, put a ggplot a graphical object to your uh, slide of PowerPoint and how to add some padding to that slide. Uh, so, uh, first of all, you would have to import your uh, officer library, then you would have to import a ggplot tool library. If you don't have any of these two libraries, you are going to open uh, your uh, R terminal and you are going to install packages and in quotation marks in uh, brackets, you are going to uh, type first officer and then ggplot2. So if you have all of those installs uh, done, uh, open uh, one empty pptx uh, document and now first thing that I'm going to do, I'm going to create slides. And I'm just going to provide this document as argument. Uh, now I'm going to uh, create one uh, data frame for employees. I'm going to name it EMP. And now data frame and just two columns, names and salary. like this. Now we are going to create ggplot object, gg1. So as I said, uh, this is not episode uh, about uh, ggplot. ggplot is one huge subject and we are going to deal with that subject in special tutorials. So for now you would have to take this for granted. So with function ggplot, I am going to provide data our data frame mapping aesthetic names and salary plus geom point now I'm going to uh, take uh, slide dimensions. Of document. So why uh, I need uh, this uh, size? If you want to do some padding, you will have to make some calculations. So now I'm going to uh, take width. like this and height like this and now I'm going to create a location for our plot and I'm going to name it lock but without k function ph location make some space and now it's going to be 0 0.5 inches from the top and 0 0.5 inches from the left. So I'm going to make padding uh, of uh, 0 0.5 inches. And now it's where uh, magic happens. So with width, you would uh, have to subtract one inch from a uh, width of uh, this uh, document. Why is that? If you want to have 0 0.5 inches padding, that means that you will have 0 0.5 inches on all sides. Uh, what that means for a width? 
means that you are going to have 0.5 inches at the beginning and 0.5 inches at the end of this slide. Uh, so uh, if you want uh, to uh, make that difference, you are going to uh, subtract one inch from width. And then if you start from 0 0.5, uh, you will have uh, 0 0.5 left at the beginning. And we are going to do exactly the same for the height. We are going to subtract one inch from the height. And now we are going to put that all together. Document is going to be first argument. Value is going to be GG1. And location is going to be this lock. And if we run our code, you see everything is fine. And now I'm going to check that document right here. You see, uh, we have our ggplot graphical object in the middle and we have 0 0.5 inches uh, padding. So this would be all for this episode. If you like this content, please subscribe and see ya.